Coach E here. If you are struggling with internal rotation of the hips and you want to strengthen that movement, which is kind of hard to target, I have a really good exercise for you using a band, any type of band, just making sure that you are getting the right amount of tension. So sometimes when you first start, start light, and then you might be able to really load this one up as time goes on. And then a small Pilates ball. This one's actually a little smaller than I usually use, but it will work for today. Now let me show you what this looks like. I'll move back. I have put the bands, and for me, I need to use two now. Put the ball in between your knees, right here in that fleshy part of the knees. So from here, with start with your head down, and then you can work on holding, holding it up and getting a little bit of a isometric contraction, a hold in the core. But start with the head down. Flex your feet, and then press outward. So for me, I gotta lower this down a little bit closer to my feet. So press it out while you're squeezing the ball in. So you're squeezing in while you're externally or internally rotating in the hips by externally moving the legs out. So it's kind of a weird thing to, to just coach, but you have to try it out yourself. It's very helpful. So we squeeze the ball as we bring our, our legs out, which makes our hips internally rotate, and then we come in. So it's out and in. I start with 10 repetitions with both legs. And then I'm just gonna work one leg at a time. So I hold this static. I don't wanna move, say, the left leg, and my right leg will move out and in for 10. Now this will actually start to burn a little bit in the glute medius too, which is nice, because if you're trying to strengthen that area, you're also hitting a little bit of adductors as well. So again, a really good movement, and I'll show you from this position too. So you can see it. So I move my bands down a little bit. Again, you have to play different bands depending on how long they are, how short they are, are gonna hit this differently. So if you're working with clients, don't mind how dirty my shoes are. We're going to open, flexing the feet and close. Open, now I'm pushing tension into that ball and close. Open and close after I do two, 10 together. I'm gonna work on just one at a time. See here? One at a time. That is it. Try it out. Let me know how it feels in your body. I think you will really like it. I know I do, especially recovering. When I had to recover from back surgery in my postpartum period, this was one of those exercises that was low intensity, but really targeted for the areas that I needed to strengthen. So let me know in the comments below if you have any questions, comments.